Hey guys, um, welcome back to my subscribers and if you're new here, hello, my name is Ketsia. This is my channel Ketsia's Reads where I do mostly book related content but I also do hauls, I sometimes do movie reviews and I do, you know, do lots of things. Okay, so yeah, so <laughs> you, you know what this video is about, you saw the thumbnail. Um, okay, so why Ketsia, why you want to apply to a cemetery? Um, a few days ago, if you would have said to me that I was going to go to a cemetery to ask for a job, I would have laughed at your face and probably told you that you should seek psychiatric help. <laughs> I don't know, but okay. So yeah, it's just that, okay. The thing is, my parents have been bugging me recently that I should get a job and I should just go out of the house because I'm I'm like a homebody I, I really like staying at home and especially um, like I'm using this pandemic as an excuse to like stay at home more because I just I don't really like going out that much um, but yeah but today I the day I'm filming this video I had my uh, I had a class I'm taking uh, fashion design classes so every every Tuesday and I think I only have one class left so I so if I today that I got out of the house I had to get out I'm going to go and uh, go to the local cemetery it's about 15 um, minutes away from my house 10 15 so it's very it's near very near um yeah and so I'm um, my parents want me to look for a job and I'm looking for I'm going to look for a job at the cemetery I don't really know much about cemeteries um, I don't even know where the I got the idea I mean for some time now I've wanted to like I've always been like kind of interested in in cemeteries and you know all, all the process and just the way that people have different types of, of grieving when you know when the loved ones pass and I just want I maybe I would be very interesting to to see that, and also, you know, I think everybody, every human being, has this this fear of death because, first of all, it's something that's going to happen to all of us um, one day. We don't know when. That's you know that uh, only God knows when our last day here will be. Um, you know, but our souls are eternal. You know, that's my belief. And even when I die, I know my soul is eternal. I'm going to be with my creator when I, when my, I leave this body. So I'm, I'm, I, that's uh, a peace that God brings me. But sometimes, you know, obviously as humans, we, we still, even if we are believers, we still have a little bit, you know, of, of, of are afraid of that, um, of the unknown of something we haven't experienced before so i i would like to just get out of my comfort zone that would be a lot of getting out of my comfort zone uh and you will probably think like like really but a cemetery that's isn't that like a lot of people's really uncomfortable zone <laughs> but i i would like um i mean you know i i prayed about it it if it's for me, then God will open the door, and if it's not for me, then He will close it. Um, but if it is for me, then I would like to take that opportunity to just be near, um, uh, you know, near death. Not that I want to die, but near the 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 event of death. You know, and what better place than a cemetery? Um, because, you know, uh, as I think there's like something in psychology that says this, but when you are, f are like maybe like uncomfortable or afraid of something, when you get accustomed to it, when you start knowing more about it, when you start, you know, spending more time thinking about it, doing it, um, you'll, you that fear will eventually go away and no, you'll just get used to it and this is a fact that we have to we have to get used to this is not if you want to or not this is some day you're gonna die 
and you just you have to face that and um, you know people obviously everybody knows they're gonna die but people don't really like talking about it people don't like um you know they don't like talking about obviously about death or what happens after death um so yeah i i just i don't want to be like that i i, I want to face it stare it right in the face um but yeah i'm going to go and ask i already like have have in my mind what i'm going to say like oh hello um i'm interested in you know if you are if applying for a job at the cemetery <laughs> like how many i'm 20 i'm 20 right now how many 20 year olds go to the cemetery and ask for jobs um uh, i hope i mean they probably look at me funny but um but yeah i mean if i what could happen that they say no that they don't they're not hiring anyone okay i'll leave but at least i tried and you know this is a way of me getting out of my comfort zone just by me asking if there's a job available um for me as a person that it's that is mostly introverted that for me is a goal you know it's an accomplishment for me just asking if there's a job available for a lot of people that's that's really you know easy and comfortable because they, they are extroverted extroverted but for me as maybe more shy it's a lot <laughs> but hey um you know god is with me and he gives me strength to ask <laughs> if you have a job available yeah i'm very interested in working at the cemetery uh and you know guys you if the cemetery is not only for grave digging like people have it all wrong because we only see the movies and we don't really search what the job is about but it's you know it, it has other things um in the job like landscaping um taking care of the surroundings of the cemetery so it's not all it's not just taught like being near the dead bodies uh, you know it's a lot of things and and i would like to be a part of that of of maintaining a space where where the you know the bodies of of people have passed and and you know even if their souls aren't there anymore uh there are the people that are their family that that are still alive they want to go to a place where they can remember their their family members and that the place is nice and looks pretty and i would like to be to help in making that space pretty so and peaceful and yeah maybe if this is something that god but god has planned for me then i'll land the job and if not then it was a a nice and different experiment and experience to have go to the cemetery and ask and i'll let you guys know what what they said to me let's hope it let's hope it, it's they say that they need employees and then they're so happy that people that someone ask if if they need someone so yeah <laughs> let's see how it goes guys please let, i'll see you i'll see you in a moment i'm back from the cemetery i i did it i sucked it up and i did it i went um so when i got there i i got i i went to the office of the cemetery there's like an office where people go you know they can ask questions and stuff um so yeah i was so nervous but yeah there was a lady working there um there were other people but she was like uh at the desk at the main desk so i went and i asked uh, her that you know i told her i was interested in a job at, at a cemetery and i but i was so nervous like i started my sentence with saying i know this is going to sound weird but i'm interested <laughs> in working she was like oh it's no it's not weird it's not weird it's okay and i was like oh my god like oh my god did i now make her feel bad about her job or something like <sighs> but i was so nervous okay so i told her that i was interested that you know that if they were 
hiring and she said that I can apply through a page they have online so everything is online and she told me that they have like it's a you know it's a corporation of, of uh, funerals and cemeteries cemeteries and they have a lot a lot around the island obviously the one I went to is the most the nearest to me so I would like to have a job there but you know let's see I mean it went better than I thought um, I was but I was so nervous like when I was with my phone like you know this is my phone and I was searching the site and I was so nervous like my hands were trem trembling I was like is, is this is this the site <laughs> is this the the site for the careers for for you know looking for applying for a job here she was like yeah that's this I oh, okay but I did it you know I I I don't know if I'm going to be working in the cemetery but I did it I'm proud of myself I overcame my fear of asking for if they if they were hiring anyone okay guys so thanks so much if you're watching this video um um I'm sorry I couldn't film in the cemetery I mean that will be weird because I'm filming with my computer I'm not gonna take my computer and be in the cemetery like hey you guys hey this is the cemetery so if I find pictures I'll I will be putting the pictures of the cemetery it's a very the cemetery that is near my my house is I mean it's not like near near my house but it's about a 15 minute drive um from my house so it's very big um it's very big i think i have a f maybe a few family members are that died are buried there but i don't remember because i haven't been to a funeral in years um so yeah but that is i mean it's very it's got lots and lots and lots and lots of tombstones and and yeah, it's as you. And yeah, I'm. No, I'm excited. If I can work there, that would be pretty cool. Like, how many people do you know that work at cemeteries? Like, that sounds really different, really, and you know, exciting. And yeah, guys. So thanks so much for seeing this video. Uh, <laughs> and yeah, just uh, thanks. And yeah, don't forget, uh, tell me, let me know if you know anybody that works at a cemetery or a graveyard or if you have worked in a cemetery because I would like to know your experience. I'm really interested in that. And yeah, don't forget to like, subscribe and hit the notification bell if you want to see more of my content. And if you can, you can. If you can, um, please share this video so that other people see what a nervous wreck I am. <laughs> okay guys, I'll see you on the next one. Bye!